Puntland President Saeed Denny has come to Mogadishu to campaign for Somalia's presidency. Denny has positioned himself as a top contender over the past year. The state leader has staked out a position opposing incumbent President Mohamed Farmajo while keeping a distant relationship with the Council of Presidential Candidates. Many think that he will finish in the top two or three contenders in the first round of balloting. He has come to the capital amid registration for the speaker positions in the National Assembly. Several contenders have received certificates for their candidacy since the process opened on Tuesday. Eyes will be on the legislature April 26th and 27th when balloting for those positions take place. Campaigning in Somalia isn't like you might see in other countries, where big rallies take place, often several times in one day, and candidate speeches are televised and talked about. Since only the 300 plus members of the National Assembly cast their ballots for president, it is all about engaging them to try and sway their votes. Many allege that money changes hands and preferences are bought by the contenders. Denny will be counting on the loyalty of those elected from his state, Puntland. Most appear to be his cronies, and as balloting took place in Garraway and Bosasso, he was accused of putting favorites on the ballot against straw men who were not real contenders. His ally in Jubaland, Ahmed Madobe, is thought to favor Denny with those he chose to run for the legislature in his state. While Denny's name has been mentioned on the presidential race for well over the past 18 months, he officially threw his hat in the ring in March. His record as Puntland's leader has received little scrutiny as the state media seems to be in his pocket. Garraway Online usually publishes glowing articles about his leadership. But it is likely to come down to Denny brokering a deal with another significant opposition candidate if he is to gain the votes to challenge for Majo. All eyes will be on his functions in Mogadishu to see how Denny positions himself for Election Day. That date has not been yet selected by the National Assembly but it's likely to happen in less than one month. ADN TV will continue to report on developments as Somalia moves to complete national elections.